Hello YouTube, Advisors here, and today I'm going to show you how to create a YouTube MP3 converter using Visual Basic Studio 2010. First of all, open your Visual Basic Studio and create a new project. Call it uh, YouTube Converter. Converter. Press OK. Now that we have our form, uh, you need to rename it to YouTube Convert Converter. Okay, and hide the icon. Show show icon. Change it both. Okay, and resize it like I do. Okay, like that. So uh, you have to add. And a text box and resize it. Okay, and you also have to add two buttons one for the download and one for the convert. And over here, uh, okay. So you need to rename the first button to convert and the second to download. Okay. Another thing that you have to add is uh, a web browser. Over here you have you can resize it, uh, but it doesn't matter because you must uh, Turn this to false so that when we debug our program, it won't be visible. So uh, we're ready to start coding. So double click to the form, and this window will pop up. So type in a web browser one dot navigate. Yes, uh, HTTP www dot YouTube MP3 MP3 dot org slash Okay, uh, you need to, click, to press enter and type button one dot enable enable equal to false. Okay, uh, now you have successfully created that you have successfully programmed the uh, form one. So now double click to the web browser and type system system dot windows dot forms dot web web browser web bra browser document Completed. Completed. Even. Art. Oh, we have already. Oh, sorry. Uh, so, what am I doing? I'll delete that because I have it uh, here. So, type okay, uh, DIM text DIM text of string equal to 
web web browser one dot dot document text. Okay, and uh, press enter and enter again and if text dot contain open bracket submit for close bracket then button one enable dot enable enable Enabled equal to look else button one dot enabled. Okay, uh, equal to false MSG block in bracket. Could not connect to the internet. So, a uh, comma MSG block file dot information comma. Oh. Oh. Okay. And if okay. So now we have to programize button one, which is this one. Okay. So uh, over here, type um, web browser one dot document dot get get element get element from point from oh no get element by id open bracket YouTube URL close bracket and set auto sheet open new bracket value comma text box one dot Close bracket. So uh, type and uh, press enter and type web browser one dot document dot get element by ID open bracket submit. Okay. Um, close bracket. Dot invoke in invoke number in a bracket click close the bracket okay so now let's go to our final button which will be that this one over here and type dim dl link A A S P M O element equal to web browser one dot dot man dot 
get element by ID, open bracket, DL link. Close bracket. Press enter and once again, DIN link or HTML element collection HTML element collection equal to DL slash link of get element as a uh, by tag name open bracket a close bracket dim url um, string equal to links in bracket zero close bracket dot get r to g open bracket h r e f close bracket and present system system dot diagnostic dot process dot start in bracket um url close bracket uh okay we have finished with coding so now let's go and try our program press start debugging it will be errors um okay what's in Okay, I have put close bracket. So now let's go and debug a problem. So uh, minimize that, go to Google Chrome. I will use my channel. Um, I'm going to a random video okay um, let's pick this one copy the link paste here convert and download we have a problem uh, Kind of swing okay. So, um Convert and download. What the heck? Okay, so after exploring it, I understood that a DLL was missing from my computer. So uh, let's try to get convert. Yes, and download. Okay, uh, our system is working great. So as you can see, YouTube to M3, uh, converter online, and the video is over here, so you just download it. Okay, so now let's go and stop debugging it. Close this one and save it to Visual Studio Code. So let's go and see if it's saved. 
the new project, which we can browser, bring, debug, and open the application. So here it is. Click yes. Uh, here it is. You put the URL here, press convert, and then download. And in chip 23, web page will be shown to your browser, your default browser, uh, in order to download what you want. So, um, thanks for watching this video. Like it if you found it useful, and subscribe for, subscribe for more.